Okay, today we're going to be taking the adventure back into Pineapple. I'm going to go through a couple things and explain a couple things that you can do with the pineapple for research purposes only. Alright, first thing you'll need is, of course, a pineapple. A nice container with filtered water. water. You'll need a jar with a lid and a plate. Okay, the first thing you're going to want to do is tear the top off. Do not cut it, tear it. People ask me all the time, how have you had so much success with growing pineapple tops for research purposes only? Oh, come on, you can do it. No, I can't. <laughs> you can, come on. <laughs> Tear it off. Don't cut it. Tear it. Alright, now after that, you'll want to take off the fewer leaves. Don't reach in too far, or you might pull the roots off. And yes, there's roots here. Sometimes. <laughs> pull to the side. Always pull to the side. It makes it easier and less chance of ripping the roots out when you grab them. Because you can grab it at the tip. Ah, uh, we have a root, root. Of course, you're like, I've tried this before. Or I've done this already. But for you that haven't, this will be new to you. See the roots? You gotta be careful. Can't pull down. Yeah, don't pull them. Some of them I've had had huge roots on it. Like two inches long. So be careful on pulling them. Some of them already have big roots. A bunch. Yep. And what you want to do is go up, depending on how tall it is, on the tallness, you'll want to go up about an inch to an inch and a half on taking these leaves off. Mm -hmm. Piece of plastic. Yeah, I usually go to where it takes the plastic ring off. Okay. That is going to go into the filtered water for a few days. And then what you want to do is get a pot, a potting mix in a pot, of course, and add some uh, fertilizer in it. I would go non-organic at first if you really want it to live, and then later on you can always go organically. So now that's done. The second thing we're going for is the seeds. Yes, pineapples have seeds if you didn't know. You uh, them all the time. Put it on the plate. That's why we got a plate. <laughs> uh, most people, when they cut off the skin, they cut it thick enough and they go off on it. Yeah, just cut it straight down. Go on the... Don't go too deep into it. So you just want to cut off the outer skin of it. Yeah, just go down. Me, I'll just tear them open. Tear them open. People do it different ways. I'm going to find one. So let's dig in here. I do think they small. No, it should have some. It's produced all the time in society. That I know. Gonna be this little brown thing. Put it there. Put that. Put the inside of that out. You're going on an adventure with me. <laughs> we can find them. They're in there. If not, I got two more. They should be. And did we find one? Mm. No. Cut deeper. Is that one right there? Nope. 
Okay, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna tear into this thing and find us some seats to show y'all people. Okay, we kind of butchered into the pineapple here now. Actually, two of them. We went up finding seeds in that one too, a few. But we gathered a few up here. That's what they look like. I know you really can't see them in the video here because they don't video very well. The camera don't. But if you want to come over to um, Facebook and join me with the same username, there will be some photos posted of them so you can get a better view of what they look like. But most pineapples should have seeds in it. But okay, let's get to growing the seeds now. First thing you want to do is put a little bit of water in a jar. I've actually seen this on a few other uh, YouTube channels, so make sure y'all explore around and check out the other ones. Uh, people do them different ways, and some ways are better than another, and some people try all the ways. So I encourage y'all to get on YouTube and check out the other videos on how to do all this stuff. As I did, got a few stragglers They're going on under the plate. <laughs> but you want to put them in the jar, since everybody on YouTube had good success on this, on growing them, and I've tried them in soil with no luck, with plastic wrap over the top and everything. So I gave up on it for a while, because I pretty much got my research on the tops going pretty easy, because I can start them with no problem. So I gave up on the seeds for a while, but I figured, hey, let's give it a another try since I got a bunch of them from Farmer's Market up here. So you just want me to put a little bit of water in there, get this in there, push it around, get the seeds at the bottom, lay it on its side, get them in the water, best you can. Don't put too much water. And then you put them in a warm location. And we'll see how it turns out. I'll keep you updated. Remember to like, comment, and come join me on Facebook. Thanks for watching.